So what I'm going to do now, Simon, I'm going to beat you with a cat fur. <laughs> and as I beat you with cat fur, you will get charged. And since I don't want you to be the only person who suffers under this experiment, I will also stand on an insulated stool. So if you become, for instance, positively charged, I don't know whether it's positive or negative, I would get the other amount of charge. So we share in the charge. And as I beat you, <laughs> you will charge up more and more, and I will charge up more and more, And then we will have to convince the class that, um, that we are both charged. And we will do that in a way that will be hopefully rather convincing. <laughs> I, um, let me just start beating you a little bit <laughs> to make you feel at home. We know each other, right? <laughs> OK. Now, of course, as I mentioned to you, these experiments work well when it is dry. And so if you are too wet, it won't work. But let's see, if you sweat a little bit too much, then it doesn't work too well. So are you ready? <laughs> I have here in my hand a neon flash tube. And although we don't know yet what voltage is, because we will learn about that in this course, to get a good flash out of this you need about uh, a few thousand volts. And so we will see, and we'll make it dark shortly, and I will hold the flashlight, the flash light in one hand, the neon discharge tube, and then Simon will touch it on the other side. And if we succeeded, <laughs> then you may see some light. So Simon, look at me first. Don't touch it yet, because we're going to make it all the way dark. You know where it is? It's there. OK, make it dark, uh, Marcos. Touch it. Touch it. OK, try it again. Touch it again. OK, thank you. Can we have some light? <laughs> 